gosh, that's an ex that's a that's a very uh, thought provoking question. Well, let me answer not by saying is capitalism the best system, but is a markets based approach uh, a good one to take? Yeah, I think we're always going to want for markets to play an important role in society. Um, I don't want to live in an autocracy where there's no market economy. I think that that would be um, a scary place to be. On the other hand, I don't want to live in a system in which there's no regulation of markets. So call it what you will, call it um, um, a more heterodox capitalism or um, a kind of a, a new sort of technological humanism in which maybe individuals have um, more control because of course we haven't even gotten into the fact that the, the biggest resource economically out there right now is our individual data. So as we trans, uh, transfer from a tangible to an intangible economy, it's really going to be all about mining personal data and figuring out um, what are the rules of the road for that? Um, are we going to consider this a, a, a universal human right that we should own our data? Are we going to allow the state to control it as China does? Are we going to allow companies to control it unfettered the way the US does? Are we gonna find some middle ground? I hope that there's a middle ground and, I, and I'm hopeful actually, I think the Europeans are um, pushing forward a very interesting conversation about, about what the new rules of the road might be. But I, I think that those questions, um, how big companies are regulated, how the digital landscape is regulated and how geopolitics works out are gonna shape what kind of system we have. And I hope it's one in which markets still play an important role but that individuals and governments do as well.